Let's start with this Saturday's game where the Minutemen host Quinnipiac looking for a third straight win. They take on a team that's also won three straight coming in. So let's go to head coach Derek Kellogg now and preview the matchup. The Minutemen and the Bobcats as Adidas presents the game. Thanks again and once again it's great to be back home after being on the road what uh, feels like forever uh, with the neutral site games in the Bahamas, down in Springfield, you know, traveling to East Carolina, Miami, Boston College. It feels great to be back in the Moen Center versus a very tough Quinnipiac team who uh, is coming off a big game versus a Vermont, a road game that they um, they did what they do best, which is really crash the offensive glass. They're the number one leading rebounding team in the country, and they go after the boards and do a great job of really wedging you under and getting extra possessions uh, by crashing the boards on both ends of the floor. So it's a case where we have to get back to playing UMass basketball, which is coming out as the aggressor, really pressuring the basketball, helping each other on both ends of the floor. Uh, digging down in the post against their big guys and um, I don't know how they do it but it seems every year Quinnipiac ends up with a guy that is a double-double machine this year big Ike and I, I believe his last name is Isotome and he's averaging uh, over 11 rebounds a game in the double digits the big kid Jackson the guards Johnson both of them the Johnson and Johnson brothers in the backcourt have done a great job for them and this is going to be a big time challenge for us against a team who's uh, supposed to finish very high in the league so I hope we have a great crowd as always on a Saturday uh, at the Mullen Center looking forward and great to be back home and hopefully this gets us on uh, the winning streak for a nice homestand. The game tips off at 7 o'clock Saturday. UMass is coming off a seven-day layoff. Meanwhile, the Bobcats have been off since Sunday when they won their third straight to improve to 5-4 and four on the season. If you can't make it to the Mullen Center Saturday night, you can watch it live on Nesson or listen on the radio or internet on the UMass Sports Network.